Jedi, this is Charlie Murray, and welcome back to the Jedi Consular with Shadow of Revan, Season 2, Episode 41. So, we are on Manan, as we need to speak to Theron Shan, not Theron, Theron. So yeah, Theron, not Theron. Get it? Theron, not Theron. Okay? Just once more, Theron, but not Theron. Cool. I like saying that, I don't know why. <laughs> it's so fun. Um, right, so I could just get on the mount and go quicker. I don't know why I'm walking, but I am just silly like that. Cause you know. Anyway. Hello Theron! Where are you? You are over there. All on your own. Oh, it's such a shame. You're all alone. All by yourself. Hey, I just called T3 to have him find you, and he said you were already on the way. That's some impressive timing. I know. What right? are you doing here, Theron? Digging, just like I said I would. Let me show you what I've got so far. Colonel Derek commanded our strike on Korriban, supposedly to gather valuable intelligence data, none of which has been turned over to the SIS. This is the Sith you spoke to on Tython, Darth Arcus, member of the Dark Council, organizer of the attack on the Jedi Temple. You found a connection between them? Yes. They've both been paying visits to the same genetics lab in an underwater facility here on Manan. They're headed down there again as we speak. That's not all you've discovered, is it? You found something else. Something they've already done. Exactly. With Derek and Arcus working together, the timing of the attacks makes perfect sense. They weren't really attacks at all, they were robberies. Robberies? What do you mean? The Imps hauled something out of the Jedi Temple just before you got there. A few security hollows were still working, so I got a shot of it. Derek's top guy, Commander Jensen, grabbed something similar on Corban. I ran the images through some databases. They were pieces of ancient Rakata technology. As in technology from the ruthless empire that conquered the galaxy before the founding of the Republic? Yes, you can understand my concern. I'm pretty sure Derek and Arcus have brought their Rakata tech to the lab. You're gonna have to go in and figure out exactly what they're doing with it. There. I've arranged transport to get you in, but security will probably come after you with more than smiles. Don't let them slow you down. While you're searching the lab for Arcus and Derek, I'm gonna meet with one last contact. I think she might have some interesting intel for us. She? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Good luck down there. Try me. Just tell me. Who, who, who is this mysterious woman? I, I mean, I have no idea. I, I, I no idea at all. So, you might as well tell me because I'm going to find out later on anyway. Oh, but anyway, let's move on and do the flashpoint. There's only two people on Manan. Me and that other person who just walked right past me. Well, this is, you know, Republic sides, so, but, you know. Oh, there's now four people, so good! Yay, here we go. You have entered the flashpoint in solo mode, which means... Jesus! Ah, and there's seven, apparently there's seven people. Oh, how many phases are there? Oh, there's a lot of people doing, um, a Manan flashpoint right now. Well, there we go. Theron here. I'm patched into the lab's tracking systems. Looks like Arcus and Derek are still inside. There's a security checkpoint ahead that can grant you access to the rest of the facility. Transmitting coordinates now. Okay. Oh, here's a thought. Um, um, where's my achievements? There. Have I... I can't remember if I did. I know me and Ian was a long time ago uh, trying to get all of this, but I don't think we actually did it. Uh, Depths of Manan... And then there's... Uh, have I, <laughs> only 197, eh? Well, I'll put that up, and we'll see how many we do! Oh, what's this? Side by side. Oh, that's to do with Kira Carson. Well, you can go away, I don't need you. Um, that'd be a nice, um... What is it? Quality of life change, where they could, where you could just have like specific achievements on whichever character you have them on. That'd be a nice uh, quality of life change that they have. But anyway, oh wait, no, the Coulter Barrows are only on hard mode, aren't they? Wait, I don't know. No, 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 Oh no, so, uh, wait, no. So, uh, actually no, that can go away, because it's uh, only if you're not on solo. I can't remember! But you're gonna die anyway. I think it's only when you're not on solo mode that they appear, so... Oh, well. Hi! Oh, they're all attacking me at once, are they? Well, I will do this to all of them at once. Because I like using this ability. I really shouldn't, but I like it. It's fun. Interesting. I'm seeing records of a prisoner here. Someone named Jakaro. 
Well, I bet he can share some interesting stories with us. Looks like my contacts here. The chief of security is just ahead of you. Watch your step. All right. I wonder who this uh, Jakaro is. This is a, oh, I have no idea. I, I mean, I've never met him before in my life. So uh, maybe, maybe he's 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 uh, 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 a robot or or uh, 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 a chiss. Or Zabrak can't be a can't can't be a Wookie. No, that would, just, that would just be barbaric. Couldn't be a Wookie. Defeat Security Commander Saracy. Saracy, ha ha. Was that racist? That sounded very racist, but eh, I said it anyway. Uh, oh God, not this one. I, uh, hate this one. I understood what you said there. What you said. Outsiders do not belong here. Well, tough. Yeah, that, that was a good insult, wasn't it? Yeah. No, don't move out of that. Don't move out of that. No, 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 no. Oh, oh wait. I was going to say, I haven't used that thingy yet. Yay. Oh, you're immune. I'm going to kill the droid thingies. All right. I have no idea what you're saying. I haven't got the chat up. What are you saying? Uh, give up now and you may only be imprisoned. All right, I'll give up now. Um, right, what am I doing now? Um, so I'm trying to kill the droids, but I can't. Oh, I need to kill that suppression droid. Oh, okay. I need, to, I need to go from one droid to another, to another, to another, to another. Ah, oh, it's gonna take forever, isn't it? Oh, well, I'm nearly level 60. Well, that's good. Oh, wait, I've got heroic weapon, haven't I? Duh. I'm an idiot. No, I don't, I don't want to use on, I want to use on him. God. It's taken me a lot more to get him down than the last time I, uh, attacked him. Okay, oh, hey, he's nearly down. But he's gonna transfer his power to the droids in a second, so I'm gonna have to kill the droids. Need to heal myself up. Oh, who are you? I wonder who you are. Have you been named? Probably not. Don't worry, I know who he is. Not an idiot. And you're dead. Oh, your droids get destroyed as well. That's nice, and I can use my archaeology. Or apparently not. Hello? Archaeology. Hello? Why not working? Hmm. Come on. Oh. Oh, you just Oh. Fine then, I won't use it. Um, right, I need to go over there and free whoever this person is. It's a Wookiee as well. <gasps> oh, who is it? Badass Strander. <laughs> it's a lucky day droid. Convince these saps to let us out of here. My master compliments your impressive skill. I would like to share his appreciation for this noble rescue. You don't need to clarify your master's words. I understand them perfectly well. Oh dear. Please let us out of here. We beg you. I beg for nothing, droid. <laughs> you release us. We can slaughter the rest of these backstabbers together. Why don't we start with who you are and how you got here in the first place? My esteemed master Jakaro is a specialist in discreet cargo delivery. I am his translator, C2D4, former servant of Ribbon and Queen Lena of... No one cares, droid. Get to the point. Yes, well. Jakaro was contracted by a Selkath geneticist, Garima, to deliver certain medical equipment, perfectly legal, perfectly. to this facility. But once the delivery was made, payment was never rendered. Instead, we were imprisoned and interrogated by two very unpleasant individuals. A pup soldier and an imp Sith. They attacked, they asked us questions whether we had uh, told others about our job. Insulting! Colonel Derek and Darth Arcus. We were never introduced. Very rude, to be perfectly honest. After the interrogation, they told Garima to use us as fodder for some kind of experiments. I doubt Garima could do anything to make you stranger than you already are. I'm not sure how to interpret that remark. Ah. Enough! You are here for the pub soldier, yes? To punish his betrayal? We were betrayed. Just a little digging on these two. Charges against them both for smuggling, disorderly conduct, assault. Even the droid? Yeah, why do you ask? Never mind. <laughs> By whatever they may have done, my contact has a good feeling about them. Thinks they might come in handy. Let's see if she's right. Mmm. Don't make me regret this. You'd better not betray us. I'll be watching you. 
I'll be watching you. Why do you need to jump just like a few oh, feet? Oh, you have nothing at all to worry about. I will secure my weapons to meet you. Revenge will be ours. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. You're a strange droid. Anyway, moving on. I've been slicing the facility files and I keep finding references to the Order of Shasa, some pack of force using Selkath. They aren't Jedi or Sith. I'm still not sure how they tie into all of this, but I imagine you're going to run into them. Be careful. Neither Jedi or Sith. Hmm. I wonder what that means. I wonder if I can stealth past these enemies. Let's find out. Let's stealth you. And let's see if we can go. No, we can't. Oh, well. It's worth a shot. And I'm nearly level 60. I should be level 60 with this fight, I think. I think so. There we go. Level 60 Jedi Consular. Woo! It's exciting times. There it is. I'm annoyed that they haven't done level 65 achievements for our classes as well for Knights of the Fallen Empire. I really hope they add that in the future because I'm just bothered that they didn't do it. Because that's, that's my only reason for levelling up my other characters is to get the achievement because it just gives me a purpose to level up my characters. So, you know, but no, never mind. I can stealth past you guys. Yay! Ooh, I was going to say, you nearly saw me anyway. Lower labs unlocked! Away we go! Um, I'm registering some tech near you that reads like it's from the Ricotta. See if you can't open up the network for me. I'll slice in and take a look. Alright. Hmm. This door looks awfully familiar. Like I know it from somewhere. Nah. I don't buy it. I don't see it. My thought was, whoever is doing this is related to a HK. But no, that that's impossible. This this person couldn't still be around. He's clearly dead. Do you know, here's a here's a weird thought. I could probably be level 65 by the time I get to Kotfi. Hmm, that <laughs> that would be quite interesting, I think. All right, the first Ricardo terminal done. And now we need to go to the well, that's technically the second one. But now we need to go to the first one. But that's the first one. Well, the second one done. Now to go for the second or first one. Get it? La 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 la. I'm just going to stun you, and we can be on our way. All right, and that's that one done. And don't mind me. I'm just going to make my way past without attacking you guys, unless you automatically attack me anyway. No? Good. Oh well, hello. Howdy. Oh. Oh well, you're stunned anyway. Um, but I will attack you guys. You know, I often don't know why they built this corridor. Is it just so that it can house two of these? Because I this this corridor looks like it could have been for a boss battle, which they just never added. So I don't know. It's just why why do they why do they even have that? Sure, you could just put those cultural tanks like here or here. Why have you got to build like a whole corridor for it? It just it always bothered me. I, n I never understood why. Defeat Fortuno. And he says, leave this planet and never return. Well, no. Ugh, what did you just put on the floor? Did you go icky? Ew, you're disgusting, Ortuno. Oh god, this is the one that shocks you, isn't it? Oh god, oh god. I need to get out of it now. I need to go. Crap. Um, no, let me go, let me go. Wait for him to do his thing. Another icky thing. Come on, come on, come on. Are you done? Yes, you are. Now get out of that, and then he'll shop you. <sighs> anyway, moving on. It's one of the boss fights I actually remember. Because <laughs> I remember this uh, sometimes screwed me and Ian over when we were doing this numerous times. Why is he down? 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 down? Can I kill him before he does his thingy? Did you? Oh, I was gonna say you're nearly dead, Theron. You're nearly dead, Theron. 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 Yeah, whatever. Fine. I haven't met in person, but your associate asked me to contact you while he's busy with his scanning equipment. Apparently, he's picking up powerful energy readings from Garima's laboratory. 
Readings consistent with Rakata technology. Theron and I agree that this is a dangerous sign. Whatever is going on in that lab, please do your best to stop it. Oh, well, hello. How, how are you? You, you, you? you sound very, um... Well... Ugh. I have no words. I have no words. Well, I, I look forward to meeting you, whoever you are. Are you Gorima? I am, and I'm never going to finish with so many interruptions. Go back to Derek and tell him to stop pestering me. You need me. to stop what you're doing and answer my questions. Then you aren't one of Derek's people, an intruder. What do you want from me? I want to know what Derek and Arcus are planning. What are you doing here? Creating an army, or at least the first recruits. Ricardo's technology is self-repairing, quite marvellous to observe, though quite fatal when implanted into live hosts without my special treatment process. Once the implants are accepted by the host tissues, they work in unison, enhancing strength, repair and damage, the perfect soldiers. There you are, time to learn the cost of crossing Jakaro, eel! Please, it was nothing personal. You have to understand, you're such an impressive specimen. Ugin is it key. What are you waiting for? Do it! Before he has a chance to betray us again! <laughs> that would be a bit dark if Shrander were to allow this to happen, but no. Shrander is a dark side. You don't have to be like him, Jakaro. You can be better. We play things your way, but if he even looks at me again... Well, Hello. that explains the dead guards. I knew I sensed someone familiar. I told you to let it go. You did your part. None of this concerns you. Let it go, let it go. Um, yeah, I don't think Force, uh, force Persuade is gonna work, but I'll try it anyway. You want to surrender without violence. I... want to... <laughs> Foolish tricks won't change anything, Gorina. Okay. Thank you for forwarding the research data along. Our infinite army will serve us well. You can keep the prototypes. We're working for the good of the entire galaxy, the Republic, the Empire, everyone. We can't let you interfere. What are you gonna do about it? Oh. Well, snap. Feel free to die before the facility reaches crush depth. It will probably be more comfortable that way. Hello again. I'm afraid that all of the emergency pods have been ejected, and all hatches leading back to the facility entrance are sealed. Fortunately, I procured a small watercraft for just this eventuality. The autopilot should have it docked at a hatch near your location shortly. Please hurry. Well, that's very convenient, isn't it? Whoever you are, thank you very much. Uh, skip the droids, skip the droids, don't see me. Oh, damn it, they saw me. Also, look. The champion is after you. I can sense its power from here. It's considerable. Also, I love how he said, oh, feel free to die. What am I going to do? Just decide to lie down and just drown myself in this water? This very shallow water? Nah, don't think so. Come on, Theron! Oh, hi! Your time is short. Be merciless! Defeat Stivastin. I hate this fight. I really do. Oh well, here we go. It's not working! His shield is up! If only we could destroy his shield somehow! Oh! Well, how convenient is that? But somehow I need to get him over here. Um, but the droid is doing far too much aggro. So how the frick am I supposed to do that? Um, actually, no, Theron's doing the most aggro. Okay, Theron, come over here. Come over here, Theron. Come on. Come on, boy. Come on. Here we go. Well done, Theron. Well done. 
No, no, over here. No, over here. Over here. Come on. Come on, boy. Come on. There we go. Well done. Good. Don't let up. Try my best. Yeah, Jesus. Um, Theron needs healing. Um, do you wanna do you wanna heal him? No, no. I guess I'll heal him then. Fine. Um, right, Theron, come over here. You need to um, have him burn. Burn, Sebastian, burn. Uh, danger. Three minutes remaining until facility reaches crushing point. Oh no! We need to evacuate now. Come on, Theron, get over here. Get over here, Theron. Come on. Do they purposely make it so that Jesus Droid can't be aggroed? I uh, take the most aggro. I don't know. Oh well. Dad, don't let up. I'm trying my best, but he keeps stunning me. Oh, he's nearly dead anyway. Oh, I can do this. Come on, and do that. Swipe them all away. He's nearly dead. I know you need help, but we're nearly done anyway. And okay, maybe we can't kill him. Come on. Done it. And he's dead. Excellent work. Now let's get you back to the surface. Indeed, let's go. But I need to kill these lab guardians because I can't get out of here until I defeat them. There we go. Um, right, where are we going? Um. I don't know. Oh, over there. Oh, hurry before we drown. Well, it would be the drowning. It would be the crushing. Apologies, but the remote docking procedure isn't quite finished. You're a Sith. But not your enemy. Not today. Now, are you interested in a ride back, or would you prefer to swim? Um, I might swim. Sith or not, I won't turn down a helping hand. I do appreciate a pragmatic mind. And I appreciate staying alive. Let's go. And there we are. Your transportation is ready. Safe travels. Thank you, whoever you are. And we got out in just the nick of time. Wouldn't be Star Wars if we didn't do that. Peekaboo! Right, that's the flashpoint done. And I don't know why that went away. Thank you. I take that. I probably could have got. You know, that, that's what bothers. I don't like that. I always find it um, weird how. Ooh, thingy. Um, any good loot? Nope. Um, okay. Oh, so there's one there, which is what we come out of, and then there's one there as well. Oh. Okay. I always found that a bit strange. Um, also, I don't know why that's there when I could just walk out here. And it will still do the same purpose. R right. Uh, okay. Fine. Bioware logic. Ooh, yay, I'm nearly level 61. We would have gained two levels. Well, once I do this mission, we will have gained two levels in this episode. I mean, wow, how about that? What's this mail as well? Um, update and some credits. You can read that if you want, but I just don't really read these anymore because too much information for me to deal with. Again, 8 megabyte brain, 8 megabyte brain. Um, right, let's speak to Theron, or Theron, Theron, and this mysterious Sith, whoever she is. Seems very mysterious to me. I just think it might put everyone at ease if you ditch the lightsaber. Is that really necessary? Surely I'm not as intimidating as you imply. If we just spend some time together, I'll bet we could come to an understanding. I'm confident we'll be seeing a lot of each other in the days to come. Lana Benico, dedicated Imperial citizen and fully armed Sith Lord. But you don't need to worry about that. Arcus manipulated her and her people, same as Derek did to us. She's already shared a lot of good intel. Based on your work in the lab, we know that Arcus and Derek are working together, manipulating both sides for some third party. They're Revanites, members of the Order of Revan, a secret of cult that's had its claws in the Empire for many years. It seems they've pierced the Republic now as well. I helped pull Revan out of the Maelstrom prison. I heard he died not too long afterward. Was that incorrect? Not as far as Lana or I know, but dead men can be even better cult leaders than live ones. We know the Revanites have highly placed moles in both the Republic and the Empire. That means we have no idea who we can really trust. Then it's up to us to stop them. Droid, tell them this boring this is boring and I don't care about any of it. My master, the incomparable Star Captain Jakara. Is more interested in action than discussion. 
And this is his translator, C2D4. Former interpreter for her eminence, Queen Leda of Antaran. Yeah, we got that earlier. All of it. <laughs> if you understand me, then understand this. The permanent imp left me to die. Twice. I won't rest until that I've tasted their blood. I saw your list of known accomplices earlier. Quite impressive. Could any of them help us find where these traitors might be hiding? Of course, but I do the talking, understand? Superb. Then if Theron agrees... Go ahead and get the ship prepped. I'll cover our tracks and catch up. Very well. It's been a pleasure meeting you. May the Force ever serve you. I mean, it's not may the Force be with you, but it's close. We better travel separately. If the Revenites put a tail on us, they won't know which to follow. I don't think these cultists realize who they're up against. Suits me. I better get moving. Watch your back out there. Uh, speak to Theron Shan on the Republic fleet. Away we go. You may have noticed as well that I pressed the flirt option with Lana. Hmm. Well, it can't mean anything. I'm, I'm, I must have just pressed it accidentally. I must have. Yes, it's, I, I'm not trying to make a romance with Lana. No, no, definitely. Definitely not. I mean, I'm a Jedi. I, I, I couldn't possibly. No, couldn't possibly romance a Sith as, as a Jedi. Definitely not. There you are. Our first few interviews with Jakaro's friends went well, believe it or not. We're going to start with some antique smugglers from the Exchange, see if the Revenites have gone for any other Rakata tech. Have you found any traces of Colonel Derek or Darth Arcus? Not one. Apparently, the Revenites know a thing or two about staying hidden. The Order of Revan. <laughs> My family has even more pull than I thought. You're related to Revan? You never heard that story? Bastila Shan, Revan's great Jedi love? The name made it all the way down to me, even if the Force didn't. Look, Revan was a wild card, and his crazy cult of followers is bound to be the same. Highly trained bravado aside, we're up against some long odds here. You sure you still want to be dragged into all this? That must be very weird to, uh, you know, hear about your great 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 grandfather. Or was it just like three greats? I don't know. Um... They tried to kill me. I'm not going to let that slide. You and Jakaro will make a great team. Alright. I'd better get back to Lana and Jakaro before they... do anything. I'll get in touch as soon as we get something concrete. Stay safe. I can't believe I said something like that. I, I'm, I'm not all about death. I just... Whew, something's going wrong with me. I just... First I'm flirting with a Sith, and now I'm saying bad things? What is going on with me? Anyway, level 61. Oh, what? Oh, that is a tease. How far am I? Oh, just, un just over 2,000 experience. That is a bloody tease. And that's where I'm going to leave it. Oh, no. Uh, well, anyway, next time we will do Forge Alliances Part 3. So, anyway, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, and I... We'll see you next time, and a farewell to you.